an eject. Good little ball to Simeone. Rodriguez. And space opening up on the right here for Basualdo. That's a dangerous looking cross. It's gone in. It was a mistake by the goalkeeper. But Argentina are in front. Rodriguez goes to celebrate with Basualdo, whose cross produced the opening. But I'm afraid you have to say, good though the header was, I think Iquita should have kept it out. But what a start for Argentina. Ten minutes gone, and they're in front. Yeah, well, that, that's a super cross to the back post. And there's three players coming on the back post. They're getting numbers in the box. And the force of the header, the downward header, Iquita couldn't keep it out of the net. But the thing that made it, Alan, was the pass inside the fullback to beat the offside. Simeone's header, the mistake by Iquita. Actually, for Colombian midfield, been really involved in all these games. But gives it away this time, Ruggieri. Rodriguez again. Now Franco is forward and so is Batistuta. And that's a good ball. It's in. It's another goal for Argentina. Batistuta, the leading scorer in the Copa America, has made it 2-0 in the 20th minute. And who knows, that could be the goal that wins the competition for Argentina. Here, Alan, I mean, it's Rodriguez here, I mean, the real playmaker. He's played a lovely ball over the back of the defence down the right wing. He gets it again, he's out of position, and he's beaten on his near post. You don't expect international goalkeepers to be beaten on the near post. He's got his angles wrong. Yes, I'd have to agree with you again. Higita, a question mark against his goalkeeper. Being won by the winners of this competition. It's the Copa Bolivia, another trophy that goes to the runners-up. Likely to be Brazil. No, oh, that'll be a major disappointment to them, particularly as holders of the, the real trophy. Colombia looking dangerous. Medin pushing it through. That's a useful little ball. And Basualdo got caught. And that's an excellent goal. The whistle has gone, and I'm not sure whether the referee is saying get the ball out of the net and get on with it, or what on earth is going on here, or has he disallowed it? I can't see that he has, it looked a good goal, Don. Well, to be honest, I could see that goal coming. I think the Argentines at the moment look very tired. The sharpness is gone, the passing's gone, the two front players don't seem as though they want to get on the end of anything. Dia Via certainly got on the end of that one beautifully and he has been such an effective little striker in this tournament that you uh, always feel when he gets himself into a position like this he knows where the net is now that could really dramatically change things